ericmwathethmother.com. Let's take a look at Bitcoin. Now, this is going to be the third of a series of videos. The first two. So, let me show you the first two videos. The first one is uh, right here. So, this is a follow-up to this video. And by the end, it's going to be one of three. This is going to be the last one in the series. And there's another one I made, I believe, this morning, which is going to end up being two of three. And this current video is going to be number three of three. I'm going to end this series right here. This is to pretty much help anybody who's trying to understand how to time an instrument that is falling off. As we've seen Bitcoin come off the highs here. And that's been a huge, huge reversal. We're talking about from 14,000, no, 11,400. So the low for the day, I believe, is at 9,000. So we are talking about a loss of 2,400 over the last two days from the highs here. Now, if you follow up with this series, so before you come to watch this video, make sure you've watched the previous two videos. I'll have the link the links to the videos in the description of the video. Oh, by the way, right now, let's take a look at a snapshot of where Bitcoin is trading as is being reported by the Poloniex exchange. So there is a price at about 9495. Now, if you follow along over the last two series of videos, we've seen that there's been support here on this line of those lows. This morning, I was talking about potential support there the market held so that's good and now what i'm talking about here is this potential support go back to video number one and we know that holding above this line is a big deal so right now if this can continue holding hour to hour for those of you who are day trading this if this can hold then we can anticipate holding there means that prices are gonna surge and at the same time if we break that that's going to suggest that there's still some weakness and we might have to test the lows. Ultimately though, and this is a biggie because I'm not going to follow up with another video. This line holding is a big deal right here. As long as that line holds, even if it drops below the recent lows of 9,000. So assuming prices come down, but we hold on this line that is still going to be good support. In other words, it might be forming positive divergence while prices make lower lows. So just keep that in mind. But for now, this line holding might suggest as long as that is holding, we can anticipate a recovery leg. And one final note, you can see that there is a line connecting RSI lows on the hourly. And so as long as this line is holding on the hourly, we can anticipate there's going to be some type of a bounce. Whether it's going to be a real bounce or a fake bounce, who knows. But as long as this line is holding the RSI lows line, we can anticipate that this is going to hold and bounce. Otherwise, at some point, given the big move over the last couple of months, if this breaks, then expect much, much lower downside. Now keep in mind this video would not be complete if we didn't if we don't take a look at the daily chart. So let's take a look at the daily chart to summarize here. We can see the daily continues to hold above RSI level of 69.1. So as long as the daily is holding above 69.1, that means that there's still some strength that is in the name and that it could actually recover. So watching this level on the daily is a is key to understanding whether there's going to be a bounce day today or not keep in mind if we take a look at the weekly the weekly continues to show that the rsi remains above 69.1 and of course the monthly continues to be very strong because the monthly rsi is trading at 93 and change so as long as the monthly rsi is above 69.1 irrespective of what the price is doing expect bitcoin to continue being sideways to outright bullish again to understand what i'm talking about in this video make sure you've watched the previous two videos in sequence or video one and then video two so that you can understand part three eric mother.com all the best peace and blessings i am out for now but i shall be back
with something else. This one, for now, I'm done. I am out. Mwah! Woo! Yeah!